So I'm going to show you how I process vocal phrases to get that EVP effect. Uh, for this example, I'm going to be using uh, XLN Audio's RC20 Retro Color. So I'm going to be using this phrase right here. Evil seeks evil. And the first thing I'm going to do is engage some cut filters. Have a listen. Evil seeks evil. Evil seeks evil. Awesome. And next, I'm going to add in a little bit of bit crushing. Again, I can adjust the range. So this will help give some of that digital artifact effect. Let's... Evil seeks evil. Evil seeks evil. After that, I'm going to add just a little bit of reverb. And make sure it's in mono. Evil seeks evil. Evil. Now remember, you're trying to recreate those crappy microcassette recorders that ghost hunters used to use. Before the crappy digital ones they use currently. So to do that, I'm going to add in a second instance of RC20 and just initialize a patch here. So we want to simulate these little micro cassette recorders. So I'm going to start with noise here and I'm going to select the cassette emulation. So let's have a listen to this. Evil seeks evil. Now these cassettes were extremely noisy and then we're recording out of these little crappy microphones. So I'm gonna really get extreme on the noise here. Evil seeks evil. Now we're gonna mess with the wow and flutter because these things were very inconsistent. So I'm gonna pull this all the way over to the wow and adjust the rate a little bit and have a Evil seeks. Now again, we still need to create more of a digital artifact in here because this is supposed to be communicating through electronics. So let's turn on the bit crusher and this time I'm going to lower the sample rate. Evil seeks evil. Evil seeks evil. Again, I'm gonna add in some more space. I'm gonna keep this in mono. I'm going to limit the frequency range. Turn it up a little bit. Evil seeks evil. Next, I want to really destroy this tape because most of the time the tapes that they use have been played back a thousand times or they've been re-recorded over hundreds of times. So they are pretty damaged tapes. And again, I'm going to keep this in mono. And all of this, you can adjust the tape. Evil seeks evil. Evil seeks evil. Evil. So you can still really hear what the vocal phrase is saying. Now, if you want to make it a little bit more mysterious, I'm going to come up here to the second instance of the excellent audio, and I'm going to increase the digital artifacts. And if you want to finish it off, you can add in some additional distortion. Preview. And there you have it. You have endless possibilities of how you can want this to sound. And then you can have the endless debate of what was actually said on the tape. Um, that's my favorite part of Ghost Hunters. Oh, did you hear that? 
they said blah, 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 and you really have no idea what they said. So this effect can be achieved in a thousand different ways, um, but I use the RC20 because it generally has everything I need right there in one spot. I don't have to go and hunt around for it. Um, but uh, I hope this gives you some ideas on how to create EVP style effects.